Hello, this is Federico from Garza Web Design, and I am here today to show you how to update your Drupal 7 module. So I have a website up that is in need of some module updates. So let's go ahead and uh, go into it. So the first thing you do is you're going to run cron, and that'll show us what needs to be updated. It takes a few seconds to do this, and you see here there are security updates available. So let's go ahead and click on available updates right here. And here we are. So you can see all the updates that need to be done. So let's go ahead. Uh, if you want to update all of these, go ahead and click here. But before we do that, what we need to do is we need to save a copy of the database. So let's go ahead and click configuration. Backup and migrate. Now this assumes that you have backup and migrate uh, on your website. So click that. And if you don't, you just go ahead and install that module and it should work pretty I exactly like this. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go to advanced backup. Here we are. So uh, let's go to the bottom. Gzip is what we want. And so we're going to back up. And it takes a second to do this. Here we are. So let's go ahead and save this. And here we are. I'm going to right click this and open containing folder. What I'm going to do here is just make a copy of it and put it over here and database backup and let's go ahead and copy it right there so now we have a backup of it so now we have the backup and let's go back to configuration actually what we're going to do is we're going to run cron again so what I did is I hovered over this icon and then clicked Run Cron. And there it has run. And so let's go ahead and click Available Updates. And here we are. So now we have a backup of the database on the hard drive. And so if anything happens, we can always go back to that backup. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and click all of these. and download these updates. And so it's downloading them from the Drupal server to the server in which the website is stored on. Now the website that I'm working on now is actually uh, is actually hosted with the Garza Web Design server. And here we go. Uh, updates downloaded successfully. We do have a, a calculate project update status error, and we need to work on that. Uh, that's beyond the scope of this particular tutorial. We'll cover that in another tutorial. But anyway, the updates downloaded successfully, and uh, back up your database and site before you continue. We already did that. This is just another warning to do that, and uh, make sure that this checkbox is marked, and hit continue. take a second so there it is uh, update was completed successfully your site has been taken out of maintenance mode and let's scroll to the bottom here and now uh, next steps run your database updates now another thing that you ought to do is uh, back up the files as well as the database on uh, any Garza web design site that Garza web design hosts there are backups done on a daily basis. So you don't have to worry about that. The only thing you have to worry about is the database backup. Okay, so again, here's another one. Back up your database, back up your code. We just backed up the database. As I said before, if it's a Garza web design hosted site, you don't have to worry about this. I do this for you automatically. Put your site in the maintenance mode. Uh, it's, 
and we've already done that and now we're going to go ahead and hit continue and it takes a second for all this stuff to happen and there it is so let's go ahead and go to the administration pages second to get there and here we are and let's go ahead and run cron one more time and we'll see if there's anything else that needs to be updated and it looks like everything is updated let's scroll down here module and theme status update up to date. So that's how you update a Drupal module, Drupal 7 module. So if you have any questions, please go on my website, uh, www.garzawebdesign.com. Shoot me an email, give me a call. I'll be happy to answer any questions. You have a wonderful day. Again, this is Federico Garza from Garza Web Design, uh, wishing you all the success in the world with Drupal. Thank you much. Goodbye.